Good afternoon, Tigers, and welcome to Tiger Vision News. I'm Caitlin, and this is my co-host, Riley. Thanks for joining us today. Have you ever heard of a kernel? Yeah, that's a... That's a project that Ms. Browning's reading class has recently finished. Yeah, they're pretty cool. Take a look. Hi, I'm Joby here with Ms. Browning. Can you tell us about your project? Yes, this is a kernel essay plate. They actually wrote their kernel essay on the plate, which um, follows a certain format of uh, where they were, the first moment, next moment, final moment, and what they learned. How many students created them? Um, all my classes created them. What are some, what are your students doing in class? <laughs> They're getting ready to write personal narrative essays. What's your next biggest assignment for your students? For them to write a personal narrative essay. Thank you. Hi, I'm Joby here with. Elijah. Show us, show and tell us a little bit about your project. Well, we are just supposed to make a little it's called a kernel, and put it on a plate and color it. <laughs> what did you like most about the project? Coloring. Thank you. Good work on the project, guys. Now let's take a minute to find out more about Miss Browning. Roll the spotlight, please. Hi, I'm Jada here with Miss Browning. How long have you been teaching? This is my first year. What subject do you teach? I teach seventh grade ELAR. Where did you go to college? First I went to South Plains College and then I went to Texas Tech. What's an interesting fact about yourself? Well, I'm getting married in December and my name will change to Robbie Robinette. Thank you. Hi, I'm Jada here with Maddie. What do you like about Miss Browning? She's pretty fun. She likes to do a lot of cool stuff with us. Thank you. Hi, I'm Jada here with Cooper. What do you like about Miss Browning? Um, she likes to listen to music during the class. Thank you. Thanks for the interview, Miss Browning. We'll be right back after this quick break. Now let's check in with Jaden and see what's, what's happening in weather. I'm Jaden with your weather, and our current conditions are 75 degrees Fahrenheit, partially cloudy. We have winds to the northeast with 11 miles per hour, and we have 50% precipitation. Our regional forecast is a little bit of precipitation all right here. We have dancing suns for the rest of the week. That one's the best. And our low is about the high 50s, and our high is the high 80s. I'm Jaden with your weather. Back to you. Thanks, Jaden. Now let's take a look at sports. Hello, infamous sports fans. I'm Connor, and this is Clay. And here's a look at today's sports. The guys on the football teams are preparing for some pretty tough games this week. They're getting ready to play some football. Here's more on the story. I'm Dave Seward. Nick. Soto. Cantu. How did our teams do this past football games? Good. Great. You lost 20-7. to seven. What are you looking to improve on before the next game against Laura Bush? Um, just practice harder. I guess try my best. Not get lit up three times again. And how do you expect to do against Laura Bush? Um, I'm just kill them. To crush them. Five touchdowns. No shenanigans. I'm David Seward. Christian. Isaiah. Evan. How'd you guys do against McKenzie? Pretty good. We won. We won. How do you guys expect to do against Laura Bush? I expect them to do great. Good. We're gonna kill him. That's a good attitude right there. Um, what are you looking to improve on before the next games? Hey, getting off the ball faster. Tackling. Catching. Thank you. Play hard, Tigers. The girls have been working out hard too. However, their challenge will be on the volleyball courts. Let's find out more. I'm Alex, you're with? Lauren. Caroline. Tell us about the past week's volleyball games. How did the girls do? We smacked them down. When are the next games? Monday. 
Who are they playing? Um, Hutch. I'm Alex, here with... Claire. <laughs> Kendall. Tell us about the past week's volleyball games. How did the girls do? Fabulous. Amazing. <laughs> when are the next games? Monday. Mon Monday. Who are they playing? Hutch. Hutch. What's the most exciting thing about FMS Volleyball this year? Winning, duh. Playing with Kendall. <laughs> okay, thank you. Members of the tennis team are ready for their upcoming matches. Coach C. Steph is making sure her players are ready to win. Check it out. I'm Bryson here with... Ashton. Tell us about this past week's tennis match. How did the teams do? We fought hard and fought to the finish. When do y'all play next? Um, this Saturday at the singles tournament. Who's all playing? Everyone. Why should we come out and support the tennis teams? Because it's fun to watch. With? Kaylee. Tell us about this past week's tennis match. How did the teams do? Um, we played hard and fought to the finish. When do y'all play next? Tomorrow at the singles tournament. Who's all playing? Everyone. <laughs> Why should we all come out and see it? Because me and Bryson are going to be there. Bye. <laughs> and they're twins. Thank you. Do your best, Tigers. That's a look at today's sports. Back to you. Well, that's all we have for today. Thanks for watching Tiger Vision News. Everyone have a great afternoon. We'll see you later. Until then, Tigers. Bye. Bye.